YouTube community, this is Victor bringing you the last and final update on the Styrene Junkie 66 box stock Nova. Um, I'm extremely happy and I'm extremely pleased with this car. It looks, to me, it looks awesome. Uh, it's going to be a very, very nice addition to my collection of cars that I think uh, are going to be uh, uh great to have in my collection so uh, uh, I feel that the cars that I build I, I build them to my taste and to, uh, to the way I would like a real one to be built so anyhow guys um, I've got to turn the camera around real quick I'll be right back and uh, I'll show you the, uh, the uh, freshly done uh, 66 Nova so hang on guys all right guys well I got the camera turned around so without further ado here is my box stock 66 Nova there she is I've got the uh, bare metal foil sorry for the shaky guys I got the bare metal foil around the window uh, there I got the bare metal foil around there I got the bare metal foil all the way around the window except for the bottom I kind of felt like if I did the bottom it would it, just be too much so I decided to get the uh, wipers in there so the wiper detail would come up and then the black wash grill and then there's that nice beautiful paint job very nice very shiny uh, I love this paint job. This paint job came out perfect. Uh, looks really, really good. Um, let me go back here. Let me show you. Oh, hold on. Let me go back around. Um, there's the back end. There's the Willy bars. I wasn't really gonna do the Willy bars, but I went ahead and did it anyway. I blacked out the the window. I, t I tinted it dark, man. I had to do it. Uh, for some reason, it just you know it. I don't know it kept calling it and it, I think it looks really really badass so uh, but yeah definitely uh, was a good idea I think but um, let me turn it back around to the uh, engine engine bay here, here comes the engine bay there's the engine bay there we go I think it looks pretty good uh, not too much detail but uh, it looks pretty good let's see let me back out of here let me get it under there oh, hang on let me get the underside here is the underside there we go I think it looks really really nice nice detail no paint chip no nothing I decided to leave the headers alone. I didn't. I didn't want to do the exhaust coming out the uh, the sides like that. It's not my style, so it's either not gonna have it or it's gonna have it. So obviously, I went without having it. So but there it is. So yeah, guys, this is my 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 last and final video. Uh, also, oh, before I forget, uh, I cladded the headers, both of them. Then I uh, outletted uh, the whole uh, engine bay. I forgot to let you guys know. This area right here is outclad. That area is outclad. That's outclad. The uh, radiator core support is outclad. Uh, yeah, so that's what I got, man. There she is. There she is, guys. I think she looks awesome, man. I, re I really do. Everything uh, fits perfect. Oh, almost forgot. Here's the interior. Let me see if I can get some, uh, some light in there. Hang on, guys. There's the interior. See if I can get some light in there. There we go. Let's see. There we 
go. Yeah. Got the gauges all detailed up, but another four bezels. Uh, there you go. There's the interior. I decided not to go with the uh, back seat in this car. Um, reason being, I uh, kind of felt that this is a race car. It needs to be as light as possible. So, if it were mine, uh, it definitely would not uh, have a back seat. So, yeah. Uh, that's the whole reason why I did not put a back seat in this car. So, uh, in, in case you guys were wondering. Also, this paint job is not black. It is a gray... I don't know it's real hard for the camera to pick it up but it's a gray uh, it's just a very 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 dark dark gray but I mean you can I think you can see the metallic in it but anyways guys that's it there she is she is done